The news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Subscribe to the channel, guys. Remember to follow us on all our social media platforms on Instagram, Prince Miller Entertainment, Facebook, at Prince Miller Entertainment uh, TV. We're available on the side. Yes, our podcast is a Prince Miller podcast. We're also available on uh, Twitter as a P Miller ENT. Follow us on Twitter and you'll follow back. Welcome to another edition of our daily news, breaking news, everyday news. Today is the 23rd of April, uh, 2022. So, guys, uh, here's the latest coming from South Africa. Another Zimbabwean man was killed uh, by a mob last Tuesday in Midrand, South Africa, after he allegedly attempted to hijack a car on Alandele road near Chokop open field Lemukani de Kenya Debele from Kai Matebele North reportedly got behind the wheel of the car they were trying to hijack but he failed to start the car and as a result other motorists who had seen what was happening pounced on him seeing that uh, Lemukani was in trouble his accomplice drove away leaving him at the mercy of the mob Lemukani is said to have tried to flee on foot, but the mob caught him and severely beat him. He was later found in an open space with an open wound on his head and a broken arm. Sergeant Dipelo Muremi of the Rabi Ridge South African Police Services said the now deceased was trying to hijack a car with his two friends, but they failed to do so because the mob started fighting them. His two friends used their car to escape from the scene while he tried taking the victim's car to escape using it. He failed to start the engine and the mob chased him and he was found dead. He revealed that the police were hunting for the escaped accomplices. The motorist who survived the hijack positively identified Lemukani. We know Noma Zulu Ndebele, Lemukani's sister, said she was failing to come to terms with the development. She said, I still don't believe that my brother is gone just like that it's like a dream to me we are yet to make arrangements for his burial she said they were held up by the easter holidays and so guys that's the latest year uh and yes in a crime crime doesn't pay at all it doesn't pay and uh with this whole situation in report between the local south africans and uh, zimbabweans in particular i don't go Sindo Sindo, Shokuba Mota, Shokuba Makebo, Yema Getsi, all those kind of things. No fear more queer one for you. Like the tension is high. And uh, the tension is high. I think we've been talking a lot about it here. Panya Yewa Komana and Nevaskana Barguta Zomba from South Africa. Could you guys the mood short at the same time? The Murima Zimbabwe and Chet our Pana police are want to see about Okura as you sure. Like what happened to this man? May he so rest in peace. But at the same time, this just a reminder to all the people out there that don't commit crime. Crime doesn't pay. Crime doesn't pay. Paraiba. So guys, we're gonna keep you in the loop for any new information, new development. But you know, those so in South Africa. You'll be like enough police agasokusunga. In most cases, Antokura is for sure because they don't want foreigners, especially us as Zimbabweans. The Funga Guti, Dangar Munumum, Wanga Dangombat at Zongua, or a foreigner police at Kawaya, but in Funga Razo, not a Munum foreigner, or at Iowa. We don't have mercy for foreigners here in South Africa. And yeah, Saga, he meets his fate, and yeah, and shame on those two accomplices who are. Uh, Run away, watch some more. I cheat with my one guy, so and uh, so this is what it is. That is all in the comment section. This is a daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Milan the Cement TV. Remember, guys, to like, share, comment, and follow and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that we do upload here on this channel each and every day, each and every hour. Bless up. Sinister.